All right, this is a game I call Scooter Football. Okay, uh, each one of these colored stars represents the two teams. Okay, so this is a uh, team red here. Okay, team here. <clears throat> then over here, what I got here is uh, floor tape, purple line for the end zone, purple line over here for the end zone. Obviously, the team's job is to try and score touchdowns um, by passing the football. Now, some rules of this game is if this person here, this person has the football, they are not allowed to move their scooter. They have to stay put. However, all the other the all the other teammates this teammate and this teammate and this teammate they all can move their scooters in any direction to try and get open so for instance if this guy if the person holding the ball right now passes the football to this person okay now this person is this person here is able to move whereas this person who caught the ball right here this person who caught the ball would not be able to move now the opposing team, the blue team over here, their job obviously is to play defense. Okay, so they can, this person can try and move his scooter over to here to try and intercept the ball and things like that, kind of like a regular football. Now, if that person catches the ball, then it's an interception and we're going the other direction. Now, just as in this case with the red team, with the red team, if this person here was it was able to intercept the ball, they are no longer able to move their scooter, whereas the blue team teammates now can get um, open and try and catch the ball. Some rules: uh, if the game, if the football falls on the gym floor, that's an automatic turnover for that team, and the other team gets the ball at that spot. Um, I usually play it for. Uh, I don't use downs. I just go for um, time. Um, we usually have, I play halves. And um, we go for seven points. And that's just a different way of playing football. I play it with third, fourth, and fifth graders. Um, and kids seem to really like it. Another rule as I'm thinking about it here is they are not allowed to bump their scooters into each other and things like that. Um, some safety concerns, obviously, watching out for fingers so the kids don't roll over their fingers and things like that. But uh, I've seen it played several ways, kind of take an idea from scooter hockey or scooter soccer. And um, you will you can see more um, details on this game on my blog. Thanks.